Well, the Clarence Brown Theater is wigging out. The cast and crew is ready to welcome audiences to their latest production, Hair. Arcadian Min explains how a lot of detail goes into every decision before the show. All right, we've moved a little bit over into the fitting room within the costume shop here at the Clarence Brown Theater to talk about these amazing costumes for Hair, the newest show that's going to be taking the stage. I'm here with Melissa. We've got a lot of color. We've got a lot of great hair. And you were just telling me that Hair, the show, is nostalgic for you anyway yes. to work on. Yeah, I was raised by hippies uh, in the 70s. And the movie, I watched it when I was a little kid. So it's really fun. These clothes are all very familiar to me because um, it's wet. Uh, my mom dressed me in. <laughs> so it's been really fun to see this stuff. I actually, there are a few pieces of my mom's clothes that we've brought in um, that might be on display as a part of the show. That's so special and bringing back a lot of fun memories, I'm sure. I want to talk a little bit about what you're holding and what's right here in front of it. The hair, I mean, it's the name of the show, mm -hmm. but you all said that you're using a lot of natural hair for this. We are. Uh, one really great thing about this is we get to celebrate uh, how people come to us and their natural hair and what comes to the table. So that's been very exciting. But there are a few necessary wigs to make the show. We've got some fantasy moments. This is our Margaret Mead wig. Um, these wigs have been made by... Um, by our friend Siobhan Jones, who's a great wig artist in town, and she does this beautiful work, and we're excited to get to showcase it. This one is um, for our Claude character. There's a haircut in the show, so he needed a natural wig, um, and it's just beautiful work. It takes a lot to make something look like it's naturally growing out of somebody's head, so we're really excited to showcase this piece. And also these amazing costumes right next to you, too. Uh, tell us a little bit about what these are. Um, so this is for one of our sort of fantasy moments in the show. I won't give too much away about this. And this is for one of our main troubadours. Uh, one of our former grad students is back with us. Aaliyah Vassal is going to wear this fabulous costume and just sort of reign over the tribe. As she says, she's not going to give too much away because you got to come out and you got to see the show. It's going to be a fun one for sure. I know that I'll probably be coming to see all this because this is such a tease. I'm like, I want to see how they use this. One thing I love about shows is how every theater department adapts it their own way. So come see Clarence Brown Theater's adaptation of it. And we'll go ahead and send things back over to you in studio.